Hello, 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 and happy hump day. Welcome to Pancho Thon on FB Live number 104. Woo! It's been a crazy quick couple of weeks, y'all. It is almost December. Thanksgiving was last week. I hope you had a good one. I had a quiet Thanksgiving this year. Uh, I think I needed a quiet Thanksgiving this year. I didn't even get a chance to get my turkey leg. You know, I was trying to manifest a turkey leg last week. It did work that way. I ended up getting some turkey legs the next day. Uh, from a restaurant to kind of uh, solve that problem. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed your Thanksgiving, whether it was uh, fellowshipping or quiet. I preferred quiet, but it was great. Uh, we are wrapping up the year, y'all. Wrap up the year. We'll have one exhibition that's still up right now, and that's going to be up probably till the end of the year. Uh, and this is the uh, Projay's art show. Uh, Projay's 20 Minties is a exhibition I put together where uh, I was actually asked if I would uh, do a solo exhibition at the Fred Douglas Myers uh, Maritime Museum. Uh, I've done maybe two or three exhibitions, solo exhibitions at the Herbert Thurman Gallery there in the building over the last two decades or so. So I decided rather than me do another solo exhibition, uh, I would just do a show that I honored my mentees. My mentees are artists that I've worked with. Uh, I could have done a protege 100 mentee show. But I wanted to do one that was uh, celebrating 20 or so of the artists that I work with that um, ha have made me proud of what they do. They've been very uh, dedicated to their work. And uh, so this was a wonderful show. It was very, very well attended. The show will be up almost to the end of December. So check it out. It's, uh, the gallery is open from 10 to 4, Monday through Friday. Uh, if you get a chance to check that out, do that. That will be up for a while. Uh, we just uh, did a celebration of our first open house studio shows it says 2019 just before uh covid uh about uh, two weeks ago that went rather well so we're really just wrapping up the year at this point uh you see the studio looks very very organized right now because we had a couple of big events come through uh we're trying to get things wrapped up for the year so we can get started again hey y'all if you're watching the show do me a favor share 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 the show share it with your friends share it on your page uh, tell some friends about it. If you've watched the show last week, we did some gift items, and we'll do some more gift items again today. For those of you that missed the show last week, uh, we'll be focusing on that over the next couple of weeks. If you think of something you would like for me to highlight uh, in the next couple of weeks, uh, let me know. I'll put it in the comment stream, and I will consider it. Um, uh, most of the gifts that we have here are pieces that have artwork on them. Um, I did a, uh, for, for those of you that were paying attention, I did a very, very big 50% website-wide show uh, um, sale for Black Friday and Cyber Monday. I had quite a few people that ordered. Some people took advantage of it. It was 50%. So if you wanted to say my Forgotten Journey 1 and 2 series, which cost $1,000, you could buy it for both of those pieces for $500 on 50% off sale. Black. This is the first time we did 50% on everything over the web, on the website. So if you spent over $200, you were going to get 50%. So thank you and and, and congratulations to those of you that took advantage of it. Uh, we might do that again sometime next month uh, around the end of around Christmas time. We'll keep you posted on that. But, uh, you know, got to pay attention to those emails we send out. And if you're not on our email list, make sure I get your email address. Hey, let's see who's happening out there. Who's out there in the gallery? What's going on, Mr. William Jones? Hey, how you doing? Hey, for those of you that ordered stuff from the last gift show, of course, you know, Thanksgiving did slow things down. We're getting back on track. We got about maybe five orders in the house that came in for the our big sale, a 50% off sale. So we're uh, catching up on our shipping. We should be caught up completely on our shipping by Friday. Other than that, though, we're... Um, we're rocking and rolling, and hopefully you guys will be getting ready for the holidays. Hey, Karen, why, Buster, what's happening? Thank you for tuning in. Miss Carol Gray, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, I got my folks here kind of early. Some people are still coming in the room. Uh, how are things going otherwise, y'all? I am, what am I drinking today? Well, uh, of course, I'm out of Izzy's, so I'm hydrating today. That's right, y'all. I'm hydrating all water. Uh, let's see. Mr. William Jones said, here's a reminder yesterday from last week. That's good. We know, of course, you know, the holidays did affect things a little bit. Hey, Mr. Frederick Asante, this guy right here, he is chiming in from Ghana. Wow, man. So, y'all, <laughs> we got folks from all over. That's my guy right there. 
How you doing, Frederick? Thanks for checking in. Hey, man, I owe you some money. You better send me, you better tell me how to get you some money for those last two things you made for me. I haven't forgotten you. Uh, but uh, thank you for tuning in. I'm not sure if I'm going to be there in January, February or not, but I will keep you posted. And you'll probably know before they know because you, you find me when I come to Africa. Nice to see you, brother. Thanks for checking in. Uh, Karen Wabusa says she is, uh, her pieces came in uh, too. Good. Miss uh, Sheila Wright says, hey, King, what's going on, Queen? What's going on with you? Thank you for tuning in. Uh, people are still coming into the room. So that's all I got for the holidays, y'all. What y'all got special for me? Um, my sister's birthday was uh, yesterday. And me and my sister are uh, what they call Irish. I hate anything that's Ar not Afrocentric. I got to find an African word for children or siblings born, uh, born within 12 months, 11, 12 months or children born in within the same year. That's me and my sister. We are known as Irish twins. We're 11 months apart. Her birthday day, my birthday is December 19th, and we will be the same age until the 19th of December. Isn't that fantastic? If you want to wish my baby sister a hello, 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 go to my page, my first, my Facebook page, Larry Poncho Brown, and uh, just uh, put a little note on her, on her birthday uh, wishes. Appreciate that. She, she will appreciate it too. Uh, that's right, man. That's my baby sister. That's all I got, y'all. Um, I'm I'm feeling good. I need to start creating some pieces. Um, I got a couple of good things I'm working on. If y'all looking at that, this piece right here on my table, it is a, uh, let me see if I can point to it. I always get my left and my right. This piece right here is a, um, it's a sculpture I've been building. She is made of all found objects. And I just found the perfect accent piece for her, a set of wings that come out. So I'm gonna probably give y'all a up close and view of some of the things I'm working on, I'm trying to figure out how to do that. I may have to pull out one of my movable cameras and I wanna do a show, move around radio and show you things, you guys, a few things before the year is out so I can experiment around that. Uh, other than that, that's all that's going on. Hey, what's going on, Karen Wine Bust? That's right. She is getting it already. And what's going on over here? What's happening, Miss Tanya Bruce in the house? Uh, Miss Bessie's an artist. Uh, those last couple pieces you did are hot, baby. That's right. They are hot. I said it. You're going to get a really good response to those pieces. I hope they're large. Other than that, hey, I'm going to get ready to give you the hot rules for those of you who have uh, tuned in before. Or have not tuned in before this is how we do it around here you will see a corresponding number on the uh images and you will just take that item number it's in the lower right hand corner and the word sold in the comment stream we're um broadcasting in four different locations we got um, my facebook page at larry poncho brown my facebook page at the art of poncho my facebook page at the art of poncho studio which may be combined next year i have to figure how i'm going to do that uh and on youtube on my YouTube channel. We have quite a few videos on our YouTube channel if you, if you have not ever checked it out. I think I might have over 200 videos over the last four decades. Uh, and I have to say three decades because, you know, four decades, those the older they get, the weaker they look. <laughs> but we do a pretty good job of trying to reconstruct and saving all of those things. And I know we, we treat YouTube as our archive of videos. So if you want to look around and just see what's been happening, whether it's something that happened a while back or something that's happening new. Uh, check it out. That's right. Hey, Miss Kenny Johnson, thank you for checking in. Hope all is well for you up there in New Jersey. So that's it, y'all. That's the uh, I, the, the procedures right here, the house rules. You just put the item number, the word soul, uh, in the comment stream uh, underneath for the video. Uh, if you are uh, looking at the show or viewing the show from YouTube, I will give you other instructions for that, okay? Uh, what we'll do after that is we'll send you and inbox you an, an, uh, an invoice, a PayPal invoice. You don't have to pay by PayPal, but it helps us keep our records straight. You'll get that. You can pay in any method you see, any card you see uh, uh, want to use, and or you can use uh, Cash App, which we will get to. Um, but those are the house rules. We got a $15 flat rate shipping per package. That's right, $15 flat rate per, check, per, per package. Uh, the only way you would charge twice if you got some two different gifts, like a print that goes in a tube and then a smaller piece. But most of the time, we try to fit most of the things into one package. And I think most of the things on this show will fit into one box. So that's just one of those things you want to do. And again, if you are viewing the show from YouTube, uh, just make your selections, jot them all down. And at the end of the show, send them to LarryPoncho Brown at gmail.com. 
uh, sometimes what happens on Facebook, when the show's over, the comments stay. But on YouTube, sometimes when the show's over, the comments drop and we don't have access to them quite as easily as we do from Facebook. So that's why you ask for you, we ask you to do that. Also, we accept cash at, at dollar sign the art of poncho. You'll feel free if you got your invoice that comes in, you don't want to pay through PayPal, just send us the total via cash app. Okay. Um, just remember to add the shipping handling. Sometimes people look at the show to grab one item and they send me that money, but they don't look at the shipping and handling, which I will hunt you down for. So, other than that, that are those are the house rules for those of you that are new to the show. Uh, if you're new to the show and you watch it, just make sure you send me your email address and, and your shipping address, and you will no longer be a stranger. You'll be part of the family, and we will be able to find you a lot easier. That Those are the house rules. Woo, y'all. We are trekking down. December is the end of this week. Isn't that crazy? I can't get over, y'all. It's, it's moving too fast. In any event, we're going to get ready to get this part. Right? For those who just tuned in, it's about maybe item 13. Here we go. We're going to start with item number one. Item number one, we started with last week. We're going to do this uh, again because we've got some folks that uh, may have missed the last gift show. This is another gift show. It allows us to get you some pieces that we have. This uh, we, we had packaged up for the uh, studio show that we had here. We're also going to be trying to give a uh, big event here at studio, one day event where you can just stop by. We're going to have all kinds of gift baskets and things available for you to do some quick shopping. Well, we will advertise that on the show. And then I should have a date for that. Uh, keep uh, uh, keep up with my webs on my Facebook page to find out when that's supposed to be. Okay. Uh, people are still checking into the room. Hey, Chandra Guy, thank you for so much for tuning in. We got item number one, y'all. People are still coming into the room. This is the affirmation card set. I told you how about the affirmation card set. Those have done really, really well. They are stocking stuffers. It's 12 different cards, 12 different pieces of art. And all the affirmations are done by uh, Jennifer Ayana Harrison, my partner in crime. She did the writing. And I think we're probably going to create a second box set for 2024. Uh, with some different uh, uh, affirmations on them. But these have done very, very, very well. Uh, so the item number one today is the affirmation card set, and they sell for $10. Item number one, if you like, just put item number one and sold. If you've never gotten one, hey, try them out. I think you'll like them. Um, you could, it's, it's got nice uh, affirmations on the back that you can give somebody. You can slip in a pocket. You can put it with a greeting card. If you want, if they're going through something specific, or if you know somebody that's, that's just being challenged with something, you might pick the best one, send it to them. It's a lot of flexible things you can do with this, or you can just use them to keep yourself on task with positivity, which I think is very, very important in these days. If you need that card set, need is the word I used. Just put item number one and sold, and those affirmation cards will be coming your way. Item number two. Yes, yes, yes. We have the Christmas cards now. Say Christmas cards, holiday cards, because they don't stay around very, very long. We got about, and we since we did our studio show, and uh, we got a couple of gift shows that we're going to be doing. These cards probably won't survive December. So this is your chance to grab them up if you need some cards. This right here is a 15-card box set. Come on, 15 cards with envelopes for just $10. If you need a card and you want to circulate them around, item number two is the Celebrating Our Roots holiday cards. Those sell for $10. If you need those cards, just put, and I did say need, just put item number two and sold, and those cards will be coming your way. So you can get them in the mail early, y'all. That's right, y'all. Item number two three that's right this is the rooted in unity card rooted in unity card this is a very very nice card box set. I'm a, a box card set this card has gold leaf embossed in it i really like these cards we probably only have slightly less than a dozen or around a dozen of these left in the studio so if you want a different card slightly afrocentric that says something different might even be a good uh, uh quantum crossover card then item number three is yours. Just put item number three and sold. And those uh, Unity, uh, rooted in Unity holiday cards will be yours for just $10. 15 cards and uh, envelopes in a box. That's right, y'all. Item number three and sold. And those will be coming your way. Item number four. You know, sometimes the creator just, I mean, the, the, the technology just, 
uh, moves ahead of us, but we try to keep up with it the best way we can. Item number four. You know, we do all of this. This show is completely done by one person, and that's me. So we, uh, I'm running two computers at one time. I have one computer where I do my orders. I have another set, another computer where we run a slideshow. And we pull them into the studio. And we watch them together. So, And in every graphic that you see on the screen, I'm responsible for placing those. When you guys do comments, I have to pick them and put them on the screen. So I'm actually directing the show while giving you the items. So, yeah, it's a little bit of a task, but... I've gotten it down to a science after doing it. This is our third year doing live broadcasts, and I've been teaching other artists how to do it. So, um, yeah, we're getting the hang of it. Just want you to know what's happening behind the scenes because sometimes you don't know what's happening behind the scenes. Um, Mr. William Jones says he wants three, two sets of number three, the Rooter of the Unity cards. We got that for you. And we got Nicole Cowling. That's another birthday twin. Her birthday is the exact same day as mine is December 19th. That's right. She says she wants item number one. She wants three of them. You got it. Uh, that's right. That's also my Jamaican uh, lunch uh, partner right there. So uh, she's overdue. I think, see, it's so funny. When when I'm showing up regularly and I pay, they show up. But when it's my turn, they don't show up. You know how that works. I, I'm just going to say it like that. Uh, uh, you, know, you, know, you know who you are. Item number four is the surrender matted mini print that's right this minute mini print is about 10 and a half by 10 and a half inches come signed by yours truly it's already matted just pop it into a small little frame you know i like to look for um i like to look for nice uh vintage frames from like uh secondary places uh like goodwill i like going to places like ikea um and uh target they always have really nice frames in, in that you can put these pieces on that are not expensive at all and will really set them off. This comes to you already matted, and it comes signed. If you like this piece, just put item number four and sold. And this surrender matted mini print will be yours for just $10. That's right, y'all. We're in the $10 section of the show. $10 gifts. That's what I'm talking about. Item number four, if you like that piece, just put item number four and sold in that surrender mini print matching will be coming your way um what what's what we said uh so uh yeah that's right my so my birthday twin saying that she we know we always get the large pineapple ginger with no ice and now now when i said that people don't show up when it's their turn to pay she's gonna say uh uh LOL not. That's not true. Ha! See? See? The guilty always come through. They got to defend themselves. But anyway, item number four is so. Thank you, Miss April Smith. Thank you so much for tuning in. Have not seen you in a month of Sundays, but I'm glad you're doing well. Uh, item number four, again, is the Surrender Matted Mini Print. If you like that, put item four in sold, and that mini print will be coming your way. Item number five. You know, my keyboard keeps sticking, but we're going to keep on working with it. Item number five, y'all, is a note card set to be called a Love Me As I Am note card set. It's about four cards, four um, envelopes. Uh, these cards are five by seven. They're note cards. They're blank on the inside. You can write what you want. Um, very, very popular. Some of these same images are used on the affirmation card set, too. Um, um, but if these are pieces that are, if you got folks going through a lot of stuff out there. And we've gotten so used to texting and and, and emailing and uh, conferencing that we don't send cards anymore. And I I, I design these to kind of keep us in touch with just the, the art of giving a note to somebody or giving a card to somebody. And they, we've they've done very, very well. And there's some people, some old school folks that are keeping that alive. And I'm hoping we can do that. Item number five is an attempt to allow us to stay in that space it's the Love Me As I Am no card set. They are four cards, five by seven, four envelopes for just $10. If you like that, just put item number five and sold, and those cards will be coming your way. Item number six. Now, I, these were hiding in a box in the back of the base. So what happens is when I, I have a relationship with Shades Calendar, Shades Calendar has done my calendars for the last over a decade and a, and a half, really. 
but they are also responsible for most of the gift items that we uh, present on the show. Uh, and what happens is they produce those. They might uh, do new pieces. They, um, if they, they run them in large quantities and when they sell out, they normally don't rerun those pieces. So a lot of times you, you don't get to see them. And in this case of this, we this was one of the older items. I forgot I had some in the studio. What is it, Pancho? Item number six is a compact mirror. It's a magnifying compact mirror that has my composite woman uh, image on it. So if you like that, that's uh, one of the little pieces I found in the back of the studio, y'all. If you want one of those mirrors, um, something different, something new, something fly, uh, just put item number six. And that is a composite woman compact mirror, the mag uh, magnified compact mirror, which only sells for $11. If you like that piece, just put item number six and sold. I think I only got 10 of these in the studio, y'all. Only got 10. If you like this piece, just put item number six and sold. And one of those 10 mirrors will be coming your way. Item number seven. That's right, y'all. The calendars have begun to really uh, move fast. You know, we release our calendars every August. We sell them from August to December, and then we begin to discount them in January. But what's been happening the last two years, particularly, is that the calendar has sold out before the end of December. So here it is, almost December. It's going to be December in two days. Um, so if you have not got your calendar, this is your chance to get your calendar. Um, don't call me up now at the end of December and you're looking for the calendar for January, thinking that you're early and by then you'll be late. Item number seven is the Color My Soul 2024 wall calendar. And you can get that today for $15. Item number seven and sold. And that calendar will be coming your way. Hey, Miss Wanda Leggins says she wants one of those mirrors. I don't blame you, baby, because those are very, very hard to come by. Uh, but we got to. And Miss April Smith says she wants to get one of the calendars. Hey. I'm just telling y'all, for those of you that are sleeping and you've been you doing other things, but if you have not had a chance to get my calendar, this is the opportunity to get that because I'm telling you, they will sell out before the end of December. Item number seven and sold, and the calendar will be yours for just $15. Item number eight. Um, calling all Deltas, calling all Deltas. Item number eight is a Delta card set. We pull this out every now and then around Christmas time. It just looks very Christmassy. But for those of you that are Deltas, uh, these cards are are, are, are are wonderful items that you can share with your sorors. That's right. This is the perfect time of the year. Normally, these box card sets may have four pieces and four different pieces, three cards each. Um, it's a it's a it's a twelve card box set, dozen box card set with envelopes. This is the Delta Sigma Theta No Card box set. It sells for fifteen dollars. Like that, just put item number eight and sold. And that box card set, a gold box, I might add, will be coming your way and add it to your stockings. Item number nine. We have um, a series of mini prints that we put out many, many moons ago. And the mini prints all measure eight and a half by 11. So this is a gallery, the classic gallery pack number one. The gallery pack number one has some of my most popular images in it. Uh, black is black, male and female uh, gradations and some of those other pieces. Uh, you get all eight of the cards that you see on the front of this pack for one price. You normally sell for $25 for the day or punch up number 104, one of our deals of the day. You can get the classics battery, uh, gallery pack number one for $15. It normally sells for $25. That's right. You can take this pack, open it up, and hit eight people at one time. That's right. So this is gift-giving time, y'all. This is the classic gallery pack number one. If you like that, just put out item nine and sold, and those pieces will be coming your way. Uh, Nicole says she's got, uh, she wanted item number seven. She got them. It's, um, Abe Smith says she absolutely loves them. Mrs. Uh, Wanda Leggins. Yes, I know she is a DST. Um, I will put a set of those on the side. And Miss uh, Tanya Bracy, are you a Delta Tanya? I didn't know that. Or are you just supporting the Soros? But the, the Delta card set, I mean, I'm sorry, I'm getting things mixed up here. That's for the gallery pack. We will make sure that the gallery pack comes to you, Wanda, and to you, Chandra, and to you, Tanya Bracy. All three of you will receive gallery pack 
number one if you like that pack just put item number nine and sold and that card set will be i mean that uh gallery pack set will be coming your way item number 10. whoa item number 10. that's right item number 10 y'all is uh this another gallery pack this is gallery pack number two and so this has another series of eight different mini prints in it. Uh, more of my textural pieces, family pieces. But um, that's right, y'all. Item number 10 is available. If you like that piece, just put item number 10 for the Classics Gallery Pack number two. Uh, we do have about three gallery packs, I think. We're only showing two for today. Uh, the gal Classic Gallery Pack set has eight cards in it, eight and a half by 11 on the measurements. They fit into any standard eight and a half or any 14, 11 by 14 frame. Um, item number 10, if you like that piece, just put item number 10 and sold and the classics gallery pack number two will be yours for $15, normally $25. We've got a couple people there. Hey, Karen Bust is going, oop, oop. That's right, she is a Delta. And Miss Tanya Brace says she's not a Delta, but she loves those paintings. That's right, y'all. I got you. And Miss Shandu Guy says she even wants to the gallery pack number two. I got you. Item number 10 and sold, and those pieces will be coming your way. Item number 11. I put the last because I love them. You know, I got so I got products around here that I am uh attached to, and, and this one is so cool. Let me I, I have to grab you one because the picture might not do it justice. So I got this uh pillow cover. And the pillow cover is cool because you might have one of them old raggy little pillows sitting on the sofa that needs some love. I'm going to take this out the pack so you can see it. I don't want to get any reflections on it. Where's the opening on this guy? Here we go. I just want you to see this. Because this is the kind of a, a, a product that people let get by them because it's not very, you know, it, is, it probably doesn't give it any justice on the screen. Look at that. 18 by 18 inches. I like to make that picture bigger for you so you can see it. Um, it's like 18 by 18 inches. Okay. It's really, really nice. It's got like a, a, a faux suede background on you. Take this, you stick it on any pillow that's from 18 inches down to like 15 inches. Ooh, very, very nice uh, gifts. This is a nice little gift right here. I, I really like those. I have quite a few folks that took advantage of those. Hopefully you will too. Item number 11. If you like that piece, just put item number 11. And the Composite Woman cushion cover goes for $18. If you would like item number 11, and I sure certainly do, uh, it's a nice way to dress up a sofa, a chair, a bed, whatever. We got those pillows stacked all up. You know who you are. You, you, you know who you are. You just need that one little special pillow that's in your stack. Item number 11, if you like that, just put item number 11 and sold, and that pillow cover will be coming your way. Item number 12. We are repeating this piece from last week. This is the uh, um, Composite of Women Cosmetic Organizer. It has plenty of space. I have um, all of my toiletries fit into it. even hangs, it opens up, it has different compartments in it. I have another friend that uses it for all of her camera uh uh, SD cards and all kinds of other stuff, uh, cords. It's just a nice little pouch that holds this about, about this big. Um, you know, sometimes the, uh, maybe I can pull that up for you too. I got one sitting here handy. Yeah, this one is sealed, so I don't want to open it in case you guys do order it, but here you go right here. This is a nice size. This is, a, this is a sealed bag, so I don't want to open it. I have to open it up. So let me see if I can give you guys a little pearl tour of this particular item. This is the cosmetic bag. As you can see, it's a nice little size. It's got some graphics on the background. It's got a compartment in the bottom. Let me see if I can open this up for you. Um, there you go. Look at that. It's got a hanging piece on the inside of it. It's got like a little zipper area right here for you. Put some things in there. 
It's got another zippy area right in here. And it's got a really nice size to put some other things. So it's really nice. Nice little uh, cosmetic holder or whatever you decide to do because, you know, most of my customers are so creative. Y'all use my stuff for whatever you want to use it on. So item number 12 is my cosmetic um, organizer. If you like that piece, just put item number 12 and sold in the cosmetic organizer. It will be yours for just $19 on Ponchothon number 104. That's right, y'all, 104. So let's see, Miss uh, Linda Gray says she wants item number 11. Hey, fantastic. We'll take care of that for you. Thank you so much for tuning in. We still got people coming into the room. Um, if you don't have, uh, if you've not ordered from us before, make sure you send me your email address and shipping address to my email address at Larry Pancho Brown on Facebook or to Larry Pancho Brown at gmail.com. Uh, so that I can make sure your order comes to you this evening. But I will track you down. Look out in your messages if we get disconnected. I'll take care of that for you, Miss Gray. Item number 13. Hey, you know, we put this on last uh, last week. And uh, it was Thanksgiving week. Uh, but this is a two-piece uh, cutting board set. And these, I know, will be gone by the end of December. Uh, you know, uh, like I say, when they produce these, they produce them sometimes in hundreds. And when they're sold out, they're sold out. This little two piece that the biggest one is probably 11 by 14 in size. And there's a slightly smaller one. Uh, but at one point we had a apron and we had an oven mitt and all of those items were sold. The cut, this is probably what's left of it. And we did some bathroom stuff. We had a shower curtain and a, a, a mat and some other. So that's how these products have rolling. They sell out, they sell out. Item number 13 is the Composite of Women cutting board set. They only $20, which you got to lose. That's right, y'all, item number 13. Nice little stocking stuff if you want to give somebody something a little bit. Or split that sucker up and hit two different people with item number 13. If you like that piece, just put item number 13 and sold. And those cutting boards will be coming your way and add it to your collection of things, because I think y'all should get all kinds of art-related items. One of these days, I'm going to do a cart, uh, I'm going to do a contest and have you guys send me photographs of your environment, and I'm going to give a great gift to whoever has the best environment. I got to come up with some contests for 2024. Uh, if you think of something that might be a nice contest that I could do on the air, other than trivia, I've done trivia before. I've also done the thing where I used to hide this sticker of a donkey on the tubes. Uh, I work with a company called uh, Sticker Mule. They make all of my stickers and they, they always send me a sample of their logo, which is a donkey on a sticker. So one year what we did was we, we did uh, we put put that donkey on the end of your tube. And so some of y'all didn't even realize what it was. Oh, you saw the donkey and you was like, what the hell is Pancho trying to tell me? What is this donkey sticker doing on here? Only to find out later on that we did a special drawing for those that had that symbol. So we've done some creative products, um, um, creative uh, contests in the past. If you can think of something that might be kind of kitschy, let me know. Because we want to do some different stuff for 2024. Item number 13, if you like that, just put item number 13 in soul. And the composite of woman cutting board set will be yours for just $20. Item number 13 in sold. And that will be coming your way. Hey, Miss Rachel Braxton, thank you so much for tuning in today. She's wants item number 11, two of them. That's all right. I will hold those cushion covers for you. Um, great items, great items. Matter of fact, you got to send me a picture once you get them in place. Item number 13 and sold. And those pieces will be coming your way. Item number 14. Uh, we did good with this last week. I'm showing it to you again because this is travel season. If not, you're going to be getting it. You make it all kind of resolutions for the travel you want to do. This is one of my cooler products that they came out with. I don't know how long these will be available. This is the same product. It converts from a pillow to a neck pillow. It also comes with earplugs, comes with a little shade for your eyes. You get this entire set. This is the composite of woman neck pillow set. That's right, y'all. So you take that, that piece around your neck. You unsnap it and you fold it inside each other and it becomes that pillow. So you can have a choice if you want to use the pillow or if you want to use the neck piece. Really, really nice, flexible, inexpensive product line. Item number 14. If you like that piece, just put item number 14. This would be a great gift for somebody. For those of you, you got that person that travels all the time. 
And this one's not way too big. They can convert it. They can put put it in some other places. It's multi-use. Item number 14. If you like that, just put the com uh, item number 14 and sold. And the composite of woman neck pillow set will be yours for just $22. If you like that, just put item number 14 and sold. And that will be coming your way. That's right, y'all. That's what we're doing. In the next couple of weeks, we will be focusing on the holiday season. Um, you know, it's that time of the year where you're trying to be festive, you're trying to make folk happy. So we want to try to comply by showing you some things that are in the studio that can be great gift items. Hey, y'all, you know, sometimes people ask me, hey, Poncho, what does your studio look like? I mean, I've never been to the studio. Y'all heard about the studio show. So I'll give you about a minute of uh, a tour of what my studio actually looks like. Yeah, I know y'all was out there dancing. That's right, y'all. Item number 15. Uh, yeah, that's uh, what my studio looks like. We're located at the Wicomico building. We've been in this building for about 15 years. They have not put me out of the building yet, y'all. So as long as they don't put me out, I'm here. That's where we're going to start opening up, having more events here. We used to do paint parties here. We used to do all kinds of other events. And so we're looking forward to 2024. Uh, being able to implement some of those other projects and you guys will be invited to come and check us out item number 15 y'all is the indigo magic magic work mat for those of you that had to you know a whole revolution started from us working at home and uh studying at home and having a computer designated for for doing uh conferencing that's all brand new man as a result of the COVID and and, and and some of the other changes that have taken place and so what we did was we had mouse pads up to that point, which were smaller mouse pads, just just enough to go in for your, your mouse. But we decided to come up with these work mats. It's the same material as a mouse pad, but it's just as big as your workstation. Just kind of give your workstation a little artsy thing to look at. Very, very nice piece. If you look at that mouse on the screen, that purple mouse, that is an actual size of what one of those look like. They're like 14 by 24 inches. Very, very nice size. If you want to dress up your workstation and do something different for your New Year's resolutions, because I know you want to have a couple of them. Item number 15 might be the item for you. This is the Indigo Magic Work Mat. It retails for $22 if you need that. That also makes a very, very nice gift. Just put item number 15 and sold. And the Indigo Magic Work Mat will be coming your way for just $22. Item number 16. Okay, so last week we showed this piece and, um, you know, my fans are so loyal that I make products for something specific. But they do what they want to do with it, which is the way you should be. You are the consumer. You are the person. Decides. So these were made for bathroom mats. You know how you come out in the bathroom and you just get out in the shower and this has got like a surface on the back of Kisa and then a whole nine. This was designed to be a bath mat because it was a bath mat, a curtain. It was a uh, a shower curtain and a bath mat that we came up with for the bathroom. 
And but I got people who want to hang this on the wall. You know who you are. I got into an argument just yesterday for somebody that wants to put it on the wall. And I was like, no, you just made the stand on. No, I don't want to stand on it. It's all right. So here you go. Item number 16 is a floor mat. <laughs> I have one client who bought the floor mat and they still got the original plastic that the thing was stored in. Come on, y'all. I, I appreciate the love. I appreciate <laughs> protecting these items. But it was designed to be a floor mat. Please use it as a floor mat and enjoy it. Uh, and we made it a price point where it's not going to matter. But, hey, if you want to keep yours in plastic, you go right ahead. If you want to hang yours on your living room wall, you go right ahead. Y'all do what y'all want to do, y'all. Y'all just make me smile. Item number 16 is the composite of woman memory foam mat. It is a memory foam mat. That's for the floor. If you like that, just put item number 16 and sold. And that item will be yours for just $22. That, that just tickles me a little bit. We've got a couple of people have uh, come back into the studio. We've got a couple of comments here. Let's see what we got here. Uh, Wanda and say, the desk mat is everything. I appreciate that. Miss uh, Mary Faye Claggett says, a nice work mat. Yeah, I can imagine your pieces on a work mat. That would be hot. Uh, Mr. William Jones says he needs number 15, the desk mat. Two of them. I got you. Uh, um, that's right. He does. He wants two of them. He got it. That's right, y'all. I mean, let's see who else. We got Mary Faye Clackett out there. She has, that's right. William Jones is, is just applying and waving. Thank you guys for tuning in. We appreciate you. Still got people coming in the room. Item number 16 is uh, the floor. If you like that, just put item number 16 and sold. And that piece will be coming your way and added to your housewares. Item number 17. Okay, we're getting into some catalogs that um, I think are worthy. These are different catalogs that I've done for exhibitions. Uh, this is my most recent one. I told you about this show to still run into the end of December, but you can get the exhibition catalog. You can order that from us now from, um, from, from the studio. Uh, we did sell them at the exhibition reception, uh, but we sold out of them because I didn't take enough of them there. They are available. All of our exhibition catalogs are pieces that are done in conjunction with different shows that we plan throughout the year. Um, so what we normally will do is to, uh, once we determine the length of the show, we will sometimes do a catalog dedicated to the works or the artists that are in that particular show. These catalogs are from actual exhibitions or one man shows. Um, I'll tell you which is which. This is a group show. That's up right now at Frederick Douglass Myers Museum. These are 20 artists that I have mentored in this catalog. Highlights those 20 artists. This is a nice catalog. Uh, most of the catalogs are 20, 20, 24 to 28 pages to full color. They're eight and a half by eight and a half. Uh, really nice little table, a top pieces if you really want something like that. Uh, if you like that piece, just put item number 17 in the soul. And the protégé's um, 20 mentees catalog will be yours for just $25. If you like that piece, just put item number 17 and sold, and that catalog will be coming your way. And I will sign it for you, item number 17 and sold, and that catalog will be coming your way. Item number 18. Item number 18 is um, the colorism catalog. No, Black is Black is my most popular piece. If you don't know that piece, it's three different shades of black on women's faces. We later came up with a male version of that. Um, and we've done some other pieces on that same subject. This catalog right here is a collection of all of the pieces in the colorism series, which consists of about maybe 20 paintings or so. Um, item number 18 is the colorism catalog, if you like that piece. And, and each one of the catalogs has a curatorial um, uh, uh, statement. It has a artist statement that tells you what I was thinking about those particular pieces. So um, this is a nice little collectible piece. It has my bio in the back. Um, so get a nice little cross section of how some of these series worked and what made me do certain things. The colorism catalog is item number 18. If you like that piece, just put item number 18 and sold in the colorism catalog will be coming your way for just $25. Item number 19 is the collages catalog. I, I tell people that my collages catalog is probably most intimate commentary works. My more serious works, they deal with um, social justice, they deal with um, civil rights, they deal with all kinds of other subjects that 
we don't like talking about, but I think that it's important for me to to do images to remind us of where we come from and the things we endured. So I think pound for pound, this is probably my strongest catalog because it has all of those pieces in this one uh, uh, catalog. Uh, I did an exhibition in conjunction with this with uh, the Motor House here in Baltimore City. They did an exhibition for me, uh, a solo exhibition here for me called Torn, where I showed about maybe 24 images um, out of this catalog. So if you like this piece, just put item number 19 and sold. And the Collages catalog will be coming your way and add to your book collection. Item number 20. Stronger than Pride, um, that's right, y'all. Stronger than Pride was a, a real nice solo exhibition I did in Springfield, Massachusetts with Art for the Soul Gallery quite a few years ago. Uh, it was for, probably the most original pieces that were shown in that region of the United States. Um, I think there's probably 35 to 40 pieces in that exhibition, uh, all original works. Uh, and it was up for quite a few months, too. This is the Stronger Than Pride catalog. Uh, has the cross-section pieces that were included in that solo exhibition. A uh, nice collectible piece. Uh, most of these, uh, we only print, I think, 200 copies of each one of these catalogs, and we decide whether we're going to rerun them or not. But this one right here, I think, is getting ready to sell out. Item number 20 is the Stronger Than Pride catalog. If you like that, just put the item number 20 and sold. And the Stronger Than Pride exhibition catalog will be coming your way for just $25. Uh, I've got a couple people just chiming in. William Jones says he wants item number 17, the Protégé catalog. You got it. Um, we have uh, Miss Stevens wants the Colorism catalog number 18. You got that. And we got Miss Stevens. She says, how much is item number 19? All of the uh, catalogs are $25, Miss Stevens. That's for item number 19. Uh, so if you like that catalog, item number 20, just put item number 20 and sold in the Stronger Than Pride exhibition catalog will be coming your way. Uh, Ms. Carol Gray said, what are the measurements of the bathroom mat? That's a very, very good question because they are huge. I think, uh, let me get you a quick measurement real quick, but while I'm getting the measurement for that, I'm going to have to show you something graphic so you can uh, kind of see what's happening while I take that measurement for you, Ms. Carol Gray. I'd like to get you guys the information while I have you online. Um, so we're going to get a little break. I'm going to show you one of the uh, many of you don't know that I am a closeted photographer. And so these are some of the images that I have shot over the years. And I want to dedicate more time in 2024 to my photography work. So here you go. Here is some of the photography work that I've done.
That's right, y'all. That's some of my photography. For those of you that have never seen those, um, I, I do. Um, I plan to do more of that in 2024. Uh, back to the question, where are the measurements of the bathroom mat? They are 18 by 30 inches. 18 by 30 inches. That's right. That is the measurements for the bath mat. For those of you that did not get that measurement. And uh, item number 21 is um, my soundscapes catalog. And this was actually a wonderful exhibition. It was done at City Hall Galleries. If you um, just before our uh, our prior mayor got into trouble, <laughs> seems to be a, a, a thing that happens here in Baltimore. <laughs> but she gave me the baddest ex solo exhibition at City Hall Galleries. They have two galleries there. Do they designate the community uh, projects? Uh, normally they do group shows, but I was encouraged to do a solo exhibition there. And so what I did was I decided to do a solo exhibition of my musical pieces. So we had about maybe 25 or 30 of my musical pieces in this particular exhibition. This catalog covers all of my uh, instrumental and musical pieces. Um, they gave me two artist receptions. They gave me a, a, a mayoral award. I'm forever grateful. Sometimes your hometown don't treat you like you love, but this hometown has definitely made me feel loved. And appreciate it, and I appreciate everybody that that supports that. This is the Soundscape catalog, item number twenty-one. If you like that catalog, this is uh, just twenty-five dollars. That's right. It's also a twenty-four to twenty-eight page catalog, eight and a half by eight and a half. Nice little piece to go buy your books in your collection of works. Item number twenty-one and sold in that catalog will be yours for just twenty-five dollars on Pancho Thon number one hundred four. Item number 22, as we get close to the end of our show of 25 menu. Uh, last week we showed the, I think we showed the hippo bag and the hippie bag. The difference between the hippo and the hippie is that the hippo does not have, the hobo bag, I'm sorry, I said ho, <laughs> I got my terms mixed up. This is a hobo bag. Hobo bag does not have artwork on the, the, um, the strap, okay? I think we showed both last week. This week, we're just showing the hobo bag. This is item number 22. Uh, artwork is on one side. It has uh, not, lots of space on the inside, zippered on the top. Um, this piece right here uh, sells for $27. If you like the piece, and uh, it is also the cover of my, ca of my 2024 calendar, just put item number 22 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way and added to your... Art waiter. That's right, y'all. Item number 22 and sold. And you can have the Her Rainbow Halo 2 hobo bag for $27. Item number 23. I pull this out every now and then because it is such a worthy project, a worthy book. I think that what happens over time sometimes get lost. Uh, quite a few years ago, I, did a, I was working with a project uh, called The Visions of Our 44th President. Uh, it was a tribute to Barack Obama. Uh, 44 prominent African-American artists were invited to paint a, a resin bust um, of Obama in any way they saw to paint it. it the, the piece was actually sculpted in bronze, but each artist was sent a, re a resin version of that. And so um, this book has all 44 pieces on it. I was... Uh, I did the last piece, item number 44. I was the last one, and they called me and said, hey, we got a choice between you and another artist for the last bus. And I was like, oh, man. And so they said, well, how do you feel about doing a collaboration on the last bus? And I was like, oh, I don't have a problem doing that. Who is the other artist? So they said, the other artist is Charles Bibbs. So they didn't know that me and Charles Bibbs were like homeboys. So I said, well, I, I don't have any objection to doing a a collaboration with Mr. Charles Bibbs. Um, I guess you can check with him to see if he has any objection to doing it with me. I was giggling on the inside because we, we were giggling to be able to do it together. But we were the only collaboration of the 44 pieces in this small catalog. This catalog right here is a nice catalog. It's small. I only thing I wish about this catalog is that it was larger. Okay. But as far as a collectible item, it is so precious. It is small. It's about $35. Um, it's got a lot of little insight. Each artist tells you what they were thinking, and, and it gets into um, the most historical thing that's happened in this next last decade, y'all. Item number 23 is the Visions of Our 44 President book. 
normally sells for $35, but today we're going to give it to you for a little bit cheaper for $30. If you like that piece, just put item number 23 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way and added to your collection. Item number 24. Oh, we are near the, uh, yes, I, I don't want to say we get near to the end of it because we want to probably rerun them, but the Forgotten Journey tees, the retro tees, um, we only have large sizes on it. So uh, a lot of people have been buying them and wearing them as uh, house dresses and all kinds of stuff, or spandex. You know, my people, y'all creative, y'all come up with all kinds of stuff, but this is for my larger guests, my larger uh, uh, clientele base, my larger supporters, and or anybody that's interested in a 2X or 3X of the Forgotten Journey Retro Tee. Those are the only two sizes that we have. Those shirts normally sell for $50, but today on Ponchothon, we are only selling them for $35. But what you got to do is put item number 24 and put the size either double X or triple X, okay? Item number 24 is the retro tee of the Forgotten Journey in gray because it does come in tan too. But if you like that piece, just put item number 24 and sold. And that shirt will be coming your way for just $35. It comes only in 2X and 3X. And please tell me which one it is when you put your um, comment up on the screen. Okay. Item number 24 and sold. And that shirt will be coming your way. Our last item is my Puncher Retrospective book. That's right, y'all. I had to put that at the end again today. The Puncher Retrospective book has been doing so, so well. Um, we released that book in July of last year. Uh, it uh, We have 2,000. We ran 2,000 copies of the book originally. So we have officially sold half of the edition, which is fantastic. And so we've never really... Uh, put it on sale. I think now we'll begin to uh, move it around. We may even put the book. This was all retail sales, uh, gallery sales, book signings. Um, what I'm going to do next is I'm going to probably post it on Amazon and we'll do the remaining half of the edition. Um, try to spread it out, get it to more and more people. Item number 25 is the Puncher Retrospective book. It is a 230 page book with over 300 images of my prominent printed works. That's right. If you've got one of my pieces on your wall, nine times out of 10 is in this book. This is a, uh, a legacy piece book that I did. It took me quite a few years to compile all of this. Uh, but I think that if you don't have it in your collection, it is a must have. It's probably the most, um, uh, most valuable product that we have on the market right now, I must say, because it gives you such an overview of uh, what we've been doing. So if you do not have that book, and uh, this is a perfect time to get it because we have never discounted the book. Uh, this year, we've been keeping it uh, pretty tight at the retail cost. Today, you can get it on Punchathon number 104 for just, that's right, uh, $50. If you like that book, just put item number 25 and sold, and the book will be coming your way and add to your collection. Thank you so much, uh, Chantel. I appreciate those words. Uh, Mr. William Jones says he has the tan and the gray shirt. So we'll take care of that. But thank you so much. Item number 25 is sold. And that is the Puncher Retrospective book. Perfect gift for anybody for holiday seasons. And we will see this book again in the next couple of weeks. So just be prepared to see it. Well, maybe I will have to bundle that with something else. Uh, but that's what's going on, y'all. Thank you so much for tuning in for, to the show today. Um, you know, we we try to bring you an array of things that will benefit you at different times. It's the holiday season. December is next week. I don't know if you guys are tuned in. I am tuned in. I'm going to be trying to show you some gift items that you can use uh, for the next um, how, or no, for the next couple of weeks, really. Thank you so much about the book. I appreciate that. Uh, Mr. William Jones is five copies of the retrospective book. I only have one other person that has just beat out Mr. William Jones, and that's my buddy Eric Toombs, who has purchased, I believe, six books. He bought one again this past weekend at my studio show. So that's what's going on. You know, it's not a big competition. I'm just letting you know the support that we have out there. Thank you so much for tuning into the show. We'll try to bring more things to next week, y'all. We have to go into the studio and try to come up with some surprises. We will, if you think of anything that you'd like to see me offer uh, between now and the end of the year. Ha, ha, ha. Send me a note. 
That's right. Don't be shy. Until next time, y'all, thank you for tuning in. And we will see you again next Wednesday, y'all. Have a good time. Love you much. Take care.